Entering Kuala Lumpur Airport in the grey suit, this CCTV appears to show Kim Jong-nam. He continues into the busy departures hall, where an audacious assassination is apparently about to take place. If you watch extremely closely, a figure wearing a white top seems to approach him from behind and grab him. From a different angle, the person in white throws their arms over the victim's head and applies pressure before walking away. Moments later, he speaks to airport staff and animatedly points at his face. Then he's escorted to the medical centre. There is clear commotion as he's put onto a stretcher and the room throngs with medics. Slumped in a chair, this is thought to be the last picture of him alive as the effects of the supposed poisoning took hold. So was North Korea responsible for the killing? This senior minister in South Korea seems to think so. There are five suspects with North Korean nationality, he said. And there are another additional three suspects who are believed to have North Korean nationality. But only one of the four people arrested so far is North Korean. This suspect caught on the airport CCTV is Vietnamese. North Korea stresses it had nothing to do with it. It has been seven days since the, since the incident, but there is no clear evidence on the cause of the death. And at the moment, we cannot trust the investigation by the Malaysian police. As the intrigue of Kim Jong-nam's bizarre death builds, his body remains tightly guarded at this Malaysian morgue. Julia Drucker, 5 News.